Thousands and thousands of Roblox accounts are hacked each day. I'm going to be walking you through a couple methods to make your Roblox account literally unhackable. Now, before I can show you any of these methods, you need to first understand how people are hacking Roblox accounts these days. One of the primary ways people are hacking your Roblox accounts are through beaming methods. If you don't know what beaming methods are, they basically get your cookie, which has all of your saved login data, and then they use that to log into your account. And they don't need your password, your email. They don't need any verification to get in. Once they have your cookie, they can just log into your account. So if anyone ever asks you to open up your inspect element panel, go to network or console and ever ask you to paste anything in or grab your HAR file, never do it. And of course, never put your username or password into anything. I feel like I shouldn't have to say that, but I still am going. So the very first thing you need to make sure your account never gets hacked again is make sure you have a very strong password. I know it's really simple and it's really easy to understand. And you hear a lot of people say it, but you need to make sure it's really strong. I know that's not the primary way that people even hack you nowadays. They don't even really, you know, try to crack your password, but still make sure it's pretty strong. That way you have that level of of security. Now, the next thing you need to make sure you do, you need to make sure you're enabling Roblox two-step verification. So to do that, you need to go up to your settings icon, click on settings, and make sure you have an email address right here. Now, if you go to the security tab, I believe this right here will be ticked on after you verify your email. And it's going to send an email to you anytime someone tries to log into your account, and it's going to give you a code that you have to put in. This adds a really nice level of security to your account. But if you're like me, that's not going to be enough, and you want to be even more secure. So I have the authenticated app downloaded on my phone. You can use Microsoft Authenticator, Google Authenticator. You can use any type of Authenticator app. And what these apps do is every 60 seconds, they're going to generate you a new code that you can use to log into your account. The catch is this is on your phone. They're going to have to get that key off of your phone somehow, which is just going to make it way harder for them to even be able to get into your account. Now, another thing you need to make sure is you have backup codes because these backup codes are going to help you a lot if for some reason you're having trouble getting into your account. So let's say for some reason, the Authenticator app isn't working. For me, it's always worked, but let's just say in this case, it's not working. You need to make sure you're using these backup codes that are provided by Roblox. You need to keep them in a safe and secure spot. You can keep them on a hard drive, a separate hard drive. That's what I do. That way you never run into any issues like that. Now, another thing you can do right here is where if you scroll down to if you scroll down to where it says where you're logged in, you can use this to check all the different locations and devices that people are logged into with your account. So let's just say your Roblox account just got hacked or there's some, you know, there's somebody in your account that's not supposed to be. You can go through here and check all the different locations locations of people that have logged into your account. You can click on this arrow icon and then you can literally log them out of it. Now, the very next thing you need to do is the next thing you do is go to the parental controls tab. And I know you're probably wondering why am I in the parental controls tab? You need to add a parent pin to your account. You need to add a pin to your account because it's going to make it almost impossible for anybody to do anything in your account because your pin is going to be a four digit code that they're going to have to put in any time they want to change any information about your account. So let's say for some reason, somebody gets into my account using a cookie logger, right? They're in my account and they have access. They can spend my Robux. They can go into games. They can do all that different stuff, but they cannot change any of this information right here unless they know the pin. So you guys can see where I'm going with this. This is going to make it a lot harder to be able to hack your account. But I hope this guide showed you the best security measures to use.